going on, sunshines? Welcome back to another episode. Oh my God, am I excited today. A uh, quick little story. I've been trying to find this food truck for the past five to six months, but I only found out last week that they were closed down for a year. We are out all the way down in Carousel right now. Uh, we are at Waka Waka Burger. It's like a Japanese style burger and fries. And my God, it's so affordable. The cheapest burger is $3.99, yes. $3.99 and their highest price item, I think it's $7.25, everything super, super affordable. So it's a great way to start off our cheap eat episode. Uh, you know what? Let's save the talking. Let's just go order and let's see what they're all about. Let's go. Here is the menu and I'm looking at it right now. This is the three. 99 burger I'm talking to you about they have Korean hot dogs wow it's pretty uh the variety is pretty big teriyaki cheeseburger I do not know what I want to get yet but this looks amazing this right here is their most expensive burger the chicken cutlet burger uh, actually no can I get the the regular burger which one is the more popular one the teriyaki burger or the onowakimi Okonomi, right? That one's a popular one? Yes, Okonomi is our original taste. Okay, can I get one of those? What else would you recommend? Uh, what's the Oko Poti? Oko Poti is Japanese style pudding. Okay. You get the French fries, the Okay, can I get one of those? And then if I want to have a, a corn dog, or is it a, a Japanese hot dog, what would you recommend? Which one? Oh, the one if you like sweet. I don't like sweet. Okonomi. Okay, and what's in that one? Okay. Okay. Can. Okay. 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 A uh, similar taste, right? Yeah. Uh, what's the other one? The one's just sugar. I'll, you know what? I'll get the the Okonomi corn dog then. Okay. So what I ordered was just the regular burger with lettuce, onion, ketchup, and that was only three. 99 wow what a steal uh and uh what else did i get i got the okonomi burger which she said it's very popular uh cabbage japanese uh mayo brown sauce pickled ginger on it 570 5.75 still very good deal and i got the okopoti which is the fries it's like a poutine right so that's 5.95 and it comes with japanese mayo uh binto flakes and what else did i get and i got a corn dog uh of course you gotta get a corn dog right the corn dog has uh beef sausage inside mozzarella cheese with a wheat rice paste and all that cost me 21.75 how cheap is that i'm just I'm super excited just to taste and I'm it. I'm always curious about can you really get good quality food for a very, very affordable price? Today we'll see, right? Let's just wait. Regular burger, okay, thank you. Wow, how amazing that look. The bun is still nice and hot. Okay, Poco, this is like pretty much the poutine, right? Okonomi, this is the famous one, right? Okay, wow. Thank you. Thank you. So, for all you people wanting to be a little bit more healthy, they do have a healthier option here. Uh, the kale cup noodle. Creamy taste, 100% vegetarian, so you could skip the fries, you could skip the corn dog, and get yourself something, you know what, healthier. She's like passing me all the food. Honestly, I'm really surprised with the quality. It's a good sized burger too. The bun is crispy. Everything is just so fresh, but I'm just, I'm just excited to take a bite and see is it really that good or not. Okay guys, we got our goods right here. There's actually no seating uh, where this food truck is. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back to the car and we're just gonna eat right on top of the front of the car. Okay guys, this is very, very exciting right now. Uh, like I said, there's no seat. So what I'm doing is I'm just gonna eat on top of my car. Uh, what we're gonna eat first is this corn dog. It just came out of the deep fryer and this thing is gigantic. Check out this giant 
corn dogs. This thing is massive. Holy cow. This thing is so crispy right now. It has, you know, your cabbage, your flakes on top, Japanese mayo, uh, I guess a, some kind of sugar. Look at that. That thing's huge. Let's get into this. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. Wow, this is so good. There's so much mozzarella in there. Look at that. This is incredible. Oh my God. But the outside layer, it's so crispy. The batter is amazing. I love the sugar on top, the brown sugar with the cabbage, the flakes. Oh my God, so good. This thing is honestly going to fall off this stick right now. It's that big. Where's the hot dog? Okay, what I think is the first half, it's all mozzarella cheese. And here we go. Holy wow, you see all that mozzarella? I still haven't even reached a hot dog yet, and I'm like 60% through already. I think it's at this bottom. Okay, let me bite from the bottom now, okay? I want some sausages here. Okay, I'm gonna bite from the bottom. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh my god. This sausage is so good. It's so juicy. For me, what I wish was inside there was one whole hot dog and it was just straight mozzarella from the, the top to the bottom. How amazing is that? Instead of a little bit of sausage at the end. The sausage is awesome though. So good. Ooh. By the way, these corn dogs, that's coconut sugar on it, by the way. Up next, we have their famous $3.99 burger. For an extra $1.75, you can get it with double patty, but check it out. Nice toasted bun on top, still really toasted. Uh, ketchup, lettuce, one patty, onion, check that out, okay, $3.99, let's see if it's worth it. Mm. Mm. I love the onion by the way, the patty is not too thick, it's really thin, but this just reminds me of a homemade burger, what you would do at home, it's simple. Three nine nine. It's not bad. Nice cheap lunch. If you have a small appetite, <laughs> but for me, I'm probably gonna need like five of these. Let's go. Mmm. The onion makes such a difference. It's like a simple homemade burger. Mmm. Okay. Now, let's get into their fries. It's like a poutine. Uh, you just got the flakes, got the cabbage, got the mayo. Mm. Mm. Japanese mayo are the best. I love Japanese mayo. Mm. It's got a nice little gravy in here too. Cheesy. It reminds me of any kind of poutine, but it's just the Japanese mayo that make a difference. And plus the cabbage and the flakes too. The flakes are so nice and light. Other than that, these are just french fries. Awesome. Okay. Our next burger we got is the Okonoki burger. We got their Japanese mayo, uh, red ginger, um, lettuce, Pretty uh, saucy. Mm. Mm -mm. There is so much cabbage in there. It, it's like a mouthful. Other than the cabbage, this burger tastes exactly like the regular burger earlier. It's just, yeah, it's just the cabbage that makes the difference. Nice toasted bun. I love all these buns. They're so toasted. Whew, I am getting pretty full. But you know what, guys? 
<coughs> for $21 for item, I think that's a deal. Like, that's a steal. Like, you cannot go wrong. And that's called feasting out, okay? You're probably good with just a burger and a fries, and that'd probably cost you not even $10. Let's finish this burger. Look. Okay, we're gonna take one more bite of this Okinoki burger. You know what, overall it's good. I love the toasted bun. Uh, I love the cabbage inside. The ja there's Japanese mayo and ginger, red pickle ginger on everything that I've ordered. There you go. Okay, let's keep on finishing this uh, corn dog. Getting back to it now, now it's a little bit mushy. Actually, no, inside it's a bit mushy, but still very cool crispy on the outside. I don't know what kind of battery they use, but it is huge though. Mm. Put the sausage on. See? The sausage, it's like a quarter. This is how small. I wish it was all the way on top. Mm. One last bite. Sorry, I'm being a little dirty right now. There's just no place to sit and eat. Okay, one last bite, okay? Let's finish this. Guys, I am done for today. I am so stopped. And you know what? That only cost me $21.75. Or was it? Yeah, $21.75. And you know what? They have so many choices on their menu. If you don't want burgers, if you don't want hot dogs, you got a healthy choice. Uh, you know what? But they move around the city a lot. So I'll leave uh, their info at the description below and you can check them out. Guys, if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button right now. Click that like button if you haven't yet. And you know what? Stay tuned for our next episode. Everyone, have an amazing and blessed day, and I am out. Stay tuned. Peace.